Hi, it's Father Barry. It's Holy Saturday. It's April the 3rd. So we are in the sacred silence awaiting for the Easter Vigil and the Easter Sunday liturgies to begin. And so now it's just an empty cross. Our Lord has been taken down and placed in the tomb. There's a lot of uh, crosses across America. This is the famous one I've been showing you for the last week or so at St. Clement's Island. And there's another famous one in Maryland called Peace Cross in Blainsburg. Have you seen it? There's three very large crosses in America. I haven't seen any of them, but one of them is in Effington, Illinois, on some crossroads of America. And it's like almost 20 stories tall or something. And, and then there's another one uh, in Groom, Texas, off a highway in the Panhandle area of Texas. And uh, that's equally big and tall. And, and then there's another one that just recently built in Branson, uh, Missouri. And uh, hopefully these attractions, when people come to pray and, and the other things they have there, um, hopefully it brings people's attention to uh, just the wonder of Christ's cross. We're still pondering now uh, the morning after Good Friday, you know, pondering it. There's a lot of crosses all across America, and uh, Christianity is certainly here. But how much should we really live the cross? How much is a cross spirituality going on? People uh, have a difficult time with the sacrifice, the self denial part of the cross. But Jesus uh, encourages us to live it out. The psalm uh, for the Easter Vigil tonight, one of the psalms that can be done is Psalm 33. And it says, uh, Blessed the nation whose God is the Lord, the people he has chosen for his own inheritance. From heaven the Lord looks down, he sees all humankind. You know, in that line, I think of about our own nation. Are we in decline in Christianity? And it's particularly the mother church, the Catholic faith. Or are we growing? Are we deepening in faith? Are we leading people for the second coming? Are we are people prepared for the Lord and his judgment? For it says the heaven, in the heavens, the Lord looks down and sees us. Now there's a prayer also in Psalm 33 as it keeps going, verses 20 to 22. It says, Our soul waits for the Lord, who is our help and our shield. May your kindness, O Lord, be upon us, who have put our hope in you. So prayer of the vigil, the prayer of Saturday. We wait on you, Lord, under the cross. We wait on you. This is Father Barry. Thanks for joining in. We'll be back for the Daily Word on Monday, Easter Monday. And we continue also with our day-to-day -day, uh, with St. Joseph's videos. Bye.